To support a workflow design, we will need to configure several different workflow components, such as communication templates, ticket templates, workflow actions, and auto routes. Each new item that we create as part of the workflow design is added to the list. As we create new workflow designs to meet different requirements, the list grows and it becomes difficult to locate a specific item in the list. We therefore need to find an easy way to filter the list of workflow components. In this lesson, we'll look at how to use filters to manage the list of workflow actions. From the Manage menu, click Tools. Workflow Actions is a service desk tool. Click the Service Desk Channel button. Scroll down the page. And click Workflow Actions. The Workflow Actions page displays a list of all the workflow actions in the application. Remember, the system defined workflow actions are identified with a negative integer ID. When you implement CA Cloud SM, many workflow actions are configured to support the out of the box workflow configurations. As you can see, there are 151 workflow actions in the system. The gray bar above the list, which is also the search field, displays any filters applied to the list. By default, no filters are applied, and you see the entire list. To select a filter, click Filter by in the gray bar. In the filter selection lookup, you can select and deselect one or more parameters to filter the list. The main parameters are ticket type, status, and action type. In this case, you will filter the list to see only those workflow actions that are related to incident tickets, active, and non system defined. To start, you need to deselect the all option for each of the main parameters. Now, in the ticket type parameters, select incident, and in the status parameters, select active, and finally, in the action type parameters, select non system defined. Click Set Filter, and then click the refresh icon to reload the grid. Now, you see the list shows only 20 items. The list is filtered, and you can easily search for an item from the list. Remember, you can use the same process to filter the list for different workflow components, including auto routes, communication templates, and ticket templates. For more information about workflow actions, refer to the documentation wiki in the Learn menu.